Of all the waste produced in Hawaii, 35% is construction and demolition waste. That is recyclable. As Kathy Moneno tells us, Punahou School is renovating and reusing its gym to be green, too. The 28-year-old Hemeter Field House at Punahou School is getting a facelift. But it's not out with the old, in with the new. It's be careful with the old because it'll be someone else's new. It's 20,000 square feet of uh, maple gym floor, tongue and groove, beautiful material. Um, and we've been here for about two weeks. Uh, maximizing salvage, probably 98% of the flooring we're saving. Plank by plank, also saving what's called the sleeper subfloor, Douglas fir. The bleacher boards were saved as well, all done by the nonprofit Reuse Hawaii, which is a state licensed demolition contractor. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer to do deconstruction for obvious reasons because it's a more methodical process. Uh, but we're finding that uh, with our, the strategies that we implement with our deconstruction program, we're able to be competitive with demolition. The salvaged wood is taken to Reuse's Kaka'ako retail yard, where it's prepared and sold for reuse, just probably not for a basketball court. Yeah. People that are reusing the maple flooring are green builders, uh, contractors and do-it-yourself homeowner type people. Lots of people want to use salvage material because it's environmentally friendly. Also, they're probably going to save a lot of money as compared to buying new material. Vidum says the wood salvage from the gym represents nearly 113 trees and nearly 29,000 cubic feet of material diverted from a landfill. By the way, the new gym has energy-efficient lighting as well. At Punahou School, Kathy Muneno, KHO.